spokesperson for 433 in front of the White House 84 immediately canceled U.S. South Korea joint nuclear war exercise against North Korea in August as a prelude to nuclear war. First, from August 10th to 26th, U.S. South Korea joint military exercise is held. The U.S. Department of Defense said, Obviously, the readiness of the Korean Peninsula is bitter, it's critical, and we are still committed to it. And fourthly, implemented the joint military exercise. In particular, by declaring ready to fight tonight, it clarified that this military exercise is a nuclear war exercise against North Korea. Meanwhile, the Republicans of the U.S. House of Representatives introduced a resolution denouncing the horrors of socialism and organized isolation and pressure okay, okay, okay. maneuvers against North Korea. Due to the hostile policies of the United States against North Korea, the nuclear war crisis on the Korean Peninsula has moved to a higher level. Second, the August joint U.S.-South Korean military exercise is conducted as political and military tension is escalating around the Korean Peninsula. Therefore, this invasion exercise is extremely dangerous. The British carrier strike group, led by the aircraft carrier Queen Elizabeth, is deployed in Asia. The carrier battle group, consisting of an aircraft carrier, two destroyers, two frigates, two support ships, and a submarine, is planning military exercises in the, in the Pacific region with the United States, Australia, France, Japan, New Zealand, and South Korea. A separation of the exercises with the United States carrier strike group in the South China Sea or the East China Sea. This is the only reason why the Chinese military is currently conducting military exercises in the and around the South China Sea. The joint nuclear war exercise conducted in August by the US and South Korea against North Korea is focused on the US military, which is the core of the imperialist invasion army and can be the prelude to nuclear war. Third, to prevent nuclear war from destroying mankind, the joint nuclear war exercise between the US and South Korea to invade North Korea, planned for August, must be cancelled immediately. The confrontation and conflict between North Korea and the US is at the forefront of the great conflict between the anti-imperialist and independence forces and the imperialist allied forces. Inevitably, this will provoke a third nuclear world war. The immediate cancellation of all nuclear war exercises, including the joint US New South Korea nuclear war exercises against North Korea, and the withdrawal of U.S. troops from South Korea and all three foreign countries is the first task of the struggles of the Korean nation and the peoples of the world. The anti-U.S. and anti-war struggle on the Korean Peninsula and throughout the world will advance the independent reunification of Korea and world independence. August 6th. 2021, in front of the White House in Washington, D.C., spokesperson official, People's Democratic Party.